what is up everybody welcome back to real time i'm rob i'm bryce and i'm zuff and today we are back with episode seven of heartstopper this one is called bully by the name of that title i'm expecting something not great to happen this episode everything was just like super super good in the last episode like it was such just good vibes throughout uh i literally wanted to cry tears of joy at like two separate occasions but yeah with this one being called bully i can imagine we get that, our sad episode yeah I, I can feel that this is probably gonna be like something bad's gonna happen and then we're gonna have to fix it in the last episode but I i'm trying agree. to i'm trying to think of who the bully could be maybe like ben harry, harry. oh yeah I, I mean harry for sure i feel like harry's just like a minor bully though like he's not i don't know who could emerge in the second to last episode i mean i feel like he's a big time bully yeah but he just is like but it just says stuff. Yeah, you know but, what I mean? but he's Nick's friend, though. And if he finds out about Nick, true, yeah, true, could go in on him. I just feel like Ben still has some mm -hmm. evil to play. Like, he's just, I hate that guy. And I, don't I, know. I could see him being jealous of Nick and Charlie and doing something bad. I'm just, I want Elle and Tao to emerge into the last couple. They're all that is left. And I know it's going to happen, but it's just a matter of time how it happens and how it does happen. Um, I think we get it next episode. Calling it right now. Yeah, I think that is end game, like Rob said. But yeah, Nick and Charlie are officially dating to their friends, at least. Mm -hmm. Besides Still Tao. Still in secret. Besides Tao, he doesn't know at all. But the other ones do, so that's cool. Uh, hopefully, he tells them soon and in a good manner. I think it's... But I just think it's going to be in a bad manner, honestly. Yeah, I, like, I feel like... Just the fact that Tao is gonna find out that he's the last one to find, like to know, is just, just gonna upset him. He just gets pissed at everything, really. I, he I, does have a temper. Yeah, and he has a weird run. But they didn't actually. We didn't get to see. I don't, I don't even know if we'll get to see the concert. It probably is just over. Yeah. I, I don't. Yeah. I think that was sort of uh, the end of the last episode and a wrap of last episode. I don't think they're gonna see it. But uh, Darcy and Tara had that talk last episode, and I think. Uh, Tara was in a bad, a bad spot, but that talk when they got locked in their makeout room definitely, definitely helped. Uh, Darcy said some wise words and emerged her into a good spirit. So I'm excited to see where that goes. All right, guys, well, that is pretty much it before we do get into the episode. If you have been liking all of our Heartstopper reactions, please leave a like, drop a comment, and subscribe. We are getting super, super close to 100,000 subscribers, so please hit that sub button. Helps us out a lot. We really appreciate that. Check out all the links in our description as well. We got the Patreon, Discord, all of our social media is down there, as well as the address to our P.O. box. Send us something to be opened up on camera like everything you see behind us right now for our show mail time. And with all that being said, guys, we're going to get right into the episode. Heartstopper, episode 7, Bully. Let's do it. How did you appear out of nowhere? Older sister magic. Where are you going? Nick's invite me around to the cinema with his friends. Oh, he's going to the, the cinema with Nick's friends? Oh, I think it's going to be about Charlie getting bullied. Actually, we're... Me and Nick, we're kind of going out. <laughs> Hold it. <laughs> You're hanging out with his mates now? Yeah, why? I've seen him at parties and stuff. They don't seem that nice compared to Nick. I'll be fine. I don't know. I think Harry's gonna bully him. We're not boyfriends. Why would you think we're boyfriends? Mm. Fuck Ben. Doesn't want to go through that again. Nick would never say that. I mean, Nick said to he's Darcy that we're yeah. going out. He's the one who started. Or Tara. Tara. You'll be fine. Ben and Harry. Who do you think has more romance? Oh. These two yeah. or? I don't really think I'm this like Roseanne. Well, you kind of are a gay man. Oh, <laughs> they are here. Okay, <laughs> oh, they're here. And, and Ben said that they weren't coming. The two bullies that we named. <laughs> Jeez, this is gonna be rough as hell, bro. <laughs> this is gonna be the sad episode. Oh, I hate this already, bro. Why can't anybody ever bring a girl? Let's get popcorn. Why would you want to be here, Nick? Like, actually, why would you want to be here? Char. Are you okay? Char. Oh. <laughs> That's a new one. Say it again. Go on. No. Say it again. Is Ben behind him? <laughs> the heck? Oh, he sees. He definitely saw. He also knows that. Or I guess, yeah. He probably can assume. Ben's behind you. 
I love this little dude. Ben, Ben's gonna do some foul shit, bro. I know. Can't even look. Can't even look. I know they're just gonna show Ben's evil face. So Charlie Spring, quick question: What's it like being gay? <laughs> bro, what? Do you like musical? Harry, can you just piss off, please? Every time he talks, I'm like, what the hell's happening? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> what about Harry Styles? He's pretty sexy. Dude, what? I hate him. Wow, do I hate him. You think he's hot? Nick's not even my type. <laughs> oh. You definitely have a crush on him. Harry, <laughs> right. stop. Wow. Take a joke, man. It's just not a joke. You're just, har you're just bullying the kid. I want Nick to beat his ass. Not gonna lie. Oh no. Are you going out with him then? No. But you are getting with him. No, don't lie. Where the fuck did he come from? He was running. I want to go out with someone as desperate as you. You actually thought I liked you. I'm not even gay. I just felt really sorry. Okay, buddy. Wow. I was like, someone's in denial. Fuck you, Ben. Bitch ass. I want like some satisfaction from from like getting getting back at the bullies. <laughs> you might. <laughs> Go on then. What's your problem with Charlie? He doesn't exactly fit in with us, does he? <laughs> None of us are being homophobic. Oh, just shut up, Harry. You made him so uncomfortable with your gay questions. Someone really needs to learn to take a joke. No, but you weren't joking though, were you? Sure he can deal with it. Well, he's probably used to it by now. <laughs> Uh-oh. What? Uh -oh. Because he's a pathetic little fat. Oh, oh, fuck you, Harry. Oh, God. Charlie's a really special friend, isn't he? Yeah. She, uh, I think she might know now. Yeah. Yeah. Ow, I just want to beat all them up. All the 16-year-old kids. Yeah, I mean, obviously, I can't. <laughs> can you imagine Zuff just walks in? All yeah, right. I just don't think <laughs> I'm... Who's up first? <laughs> <laughs> They'd kick my ass. You clearly didn't get hugged much as a child, but if you're craving human contact that badly, you could just say so. Child, just leave it. That was a weird one. If you listen to your boyfriend, at least he knows his place. Hate him. You can't tell me you don't like him. No, yeah, he's he's gotten so much worse this episode. I mean, he was always bad. You can't tell me you don't like him. <laughs> yeah. I could tell you that. I actually could say that. Yeah. <laughs> didn't even catch that. I didn't even catch it. There he is. You know, he's his phrase. Yep. Locked in. I'm yep. Locked in between. It so works. You're in the middle. I kind of got into a fight with Harry. It makes me mad that Harry actually did some damage to. Him. I know. I just want some satisfaction towards these bullies. Okay. It's a new one. <laughs> I promise. I'm used to people saying stuff about me. You shouldn't have to be. But people shouldn't be saying stuff about you in the first place. You shouldn't have to put up with anything like that. It's true. Sorry. You're not, you're not allowed to say the S word. <laughs> you're not allowed to say it anymore. <laughs> I don't even want to be friends with those people. I'm tired. Of all of them. I'm on the same page. Those guys are absolute Aww. losers. I'm not surprised Nick tossed to a fight with him. If Harry's being a dick to Charlie, of course. Why would he? What? Why do you is think that? Something actually going on between yep. Nick and Charlie. Mm. There is. This oh. is not the way to find nope. out. Elle's gonna be the one to say it. Oh goodness. They're going out. Do all snows. Everybody. I feel so stupid. How should go? My mom's probably waiting. Tao. You late tonight? Wait. He's sad, upset, and angry. We saw that one coming. All three. All <laughs> three of those. Erase that one too, Charlie. Come on. It's supposed to be a shoe. Here. What was this supposed to be? A shoe. Thanks. I'll treasure this shoe potato always. <laughs> Dude, sometimes the things he say are so cringe. Good for him, though. I know it's not your fault he hasn't told me. 
Charlie just wants to tell you. I think I know why he hasn't. Because you've been a hater? Once you get into a relationship, friendships don't matter anymore. I don't know if that's true. Well, maybe he just thinks you're forcing Nick to watch Donnie Darko like he did with us. Weird. Truman Show and Donnie Darko have been mentioned. I don't know why I'm so afraid of being alone. You're not alone. You got me. All right, me. Oh. Not in the mood for that fight, then. <laughs> Only if it's in the form of a board game or a cake eating contest. <laughs> Did your girlfriend, George? Just give it back now! Can we get Oh. Oh, <laughs> shit. I hate you! Oh! Oh! Oh, look at them! Oh, shit. You're gonna regret that! What the hell was that? <laughs> they, just, they just faced off. I thought they looked like we were about to kiss. You're gonna regret that! <laughs> I mean, the fight with Harry was my fault. Oh, and didn't Charlie say he was supposed to be there to meet him outside? Was he supposed to be on his way? Yeah. He's probably getting jumped by all the rugby guys. I was thinking, maybe it would be better if... Don't do this. Don't do this, Charlie. Apparently Harry Green's fighting some year 10 by the picnic tables. Oh, gosh. Come on, Tao. Kick his ass. Oh, no. Hitting him with his hat. Come on, Tao. I really Come want on. you to win this yeah, fight. Yeah, me too. It'd be bad if he didn't. Nick, with the assist. They said boo. Oh, round two, round two, round two. Uh, no. Ah, oh, the drawing's all messed up. Tell me about you and Nick. Oh, oh no. I thought we were friends, but I guess you just forgot about me. Ah. Oh. this is all your fault. Just leave me alone. Oh. oh, why do I feel bad for Tao? Oh. How did this get flipped on Charlie at the end there? He was about to. Charlie was just about to d dump Nick, I think. Yeah, yeah no, literally. He, was, oh he was just about to say, I think we're better off as friends. What, dude? I uh, I think he's only he's only saying that because he thinks that, or like feels bad for the way that Nick's friends act because yeah. of this. Like, he just doesn't want to cause Nick any trouble, I think. But yeah. I think Nick this wants to be with Charlie more than anything. So. I think the solution to everything is going to be this episode, Nick is going to come out. I mean, the next episode? Yeah. This next episode, Nick's going to, he's he's got to come out. It would fix all the problems. And then, I mean, I guess Harry would probably start bullying Nick. But, I mean, fuck Harry. He's... Dude, I mean, if you just start bullying Nick when he comes out, like, how can you even say that? Well, not even being homophobic anymore. <laughs> like, yeah, dude, like, dude, you just you just are. You just are being homophobic, Harry. Like, he literally what, he went up to Charlie. He goes, "What is it like being gay?" Like, how can you ask that question? That's so fucked. I hate Harry. Harry's Fuck by far Harry. the worst character. Dude, it was so fucking weird and random too. Whenever. Charlie was walking back to the car and then out of the shadows, Ben, ben is yeah. just behind him. Dude, oh, ben, that conversation made me yeah, so angry. That, that pissed me off. That actually triggered me. Ben is just so annoying and like delusional. He's like, he's I'm like, not even gay. I felt bad for you. I just felt bad for you. That's I why just, I was made making... out with you. <laughs> yeah. What? What are you talking about? Yeah, he that boy is a cap. That I felt super, super bad for Tao though at the end. I really wanted him just to sort of unleash on Harry. I thought that would have been cool, but I mean, he held his he held his ground. I'm happy he didn't get beat up or anything. But he has heard from L about Charlie and Nick being together, and he's not happy about that. And he just got he just got he keeps getting picked. I mean, Harry Harry is the bully. Yeah. They have, like like ugh. Yeah, even though all this is happening with Tao, I feel like him and Elle are still getting a bit closer. Like, I know they're best friends, but like... They have that potato she, shoe. She just showed up, yeah, at his house to watch a film with cookies. He didn't even expect her. And I don't know. I, I feel like it, it has to happen. It has to happen. I think last yeah. episode, like, Tao and Charlie have to make up. Tao and Elle have to get together. Yeah. And obviously, Nick probably will come out. And then Tara and Darcy need to show up again. Yeah, were they even in that episode? No, they weren't at all. Oh, yeah. 
Get them back. All right, guys. Well, that is it for this video. If you have been liking all the Heartstopper reactions, please leave a like, drop a comment, and subscribe. Check out all the links in our description as well. We got the Patreon, Discord, all of our social media is down there, as well as the address to our PO box. Send us something to be opened up on camera. Like everything you see behind us right now. All that being said, guys, we'll see you next time for the Heartstopper finale. Peace out.